Hey, what's up, beautiful jellyfish? It's Tracy. I'm coming at you guys with a totally different angle today, and I'm actually filming on my phone um, because I do have my camera and it's sitting right over there, but I can't really film like videos like this where I'm moving around. Um, I don't really know why. There's definitely a reason. I just couldn't tell you what it is. Um, but basically, I wanted to kind of vlog and like show you guys kind of like what the process is behind the scenes so that you guys can kind of get a little bit of insight. A couple of disclaimers. If you can hear some weird air blowing, Paul's office has a leak right now. Both of our offices have leaked in our time of being in this house, the joys of being a homeowner. Um, and so anyways, that's what that is, if you can hear that. Um, also, I have a couple of his Star Wars figures, if you can see, they actually look super cool up there. I'll flip y'all around so you guys can see them a little bit more because it's in his office, that's where his is, and he was trying to protect his bookcases, so he like put like a sheet over there. Our house is a little bit of a mess. The second thing is, I am overcoming the flu right now, so if I sound a little bit congested, nasally, all that sort of stuff. That is the reason why. I also wanted to take you guys a little bit behind the scenes to show you guys my office because my office looks completely different since the last time we filmed an office tour like five years ago. So I figured let's just show you guys a little bit of an office. Quickest office tour ever. Okay, this is kind of like the general overview that you have. This is like a completely different got my computer, all that sort of stuff. We have our bookcases and all that jazz. Okay, so basically let's just kind of like start over here to this beautiful custom built um, entertainment center office thing. I'm not sure exactly what this is, but I have my beautiful, beautiful um, things, which I absolutely love. I've got a bunch of stuff going on. I've got some purses. I've got a couple of custom made things. This is a mini Lewis Hamilton helmet from Suzuka 2022. Um, I've got my... Um, wax making kit that Paul got from me, which I absolutely love. I have a bunch of like my sticker stuff. This is one of the best things I own. Comments my kids made about me when I worked at the middle school, which I love. I've got my makeup. I've got all my like stickers and all that sort of stuff. I've got a couple more like bags. This is really cool. Kyrie from Kingdom Hearts that Paul got me a couple years ago for Christmas. Got my little Dark Magician Girl um, deck box, which I love. I also have a little mini Agrabah Palace. We have the cats, one of their little towers. I have my work bag. These are, I don't even know what I'm going to do with these. They're like comic book binder things. Like you can, you can put your comic books in them to like sell. This is like Leia's Cheesecake Factory bag, which she absolutely loves. We also have our beautiful floors, which I also love. Um, got my extra chair there. Um, I've got my little like robe thing and whatnot. And then we have our color-coded bookshelves, which all of these books I have read. The only exception to that is all the Shakespeare books, which I'm actually going to be sending to a friend, so that's that. And then we have Paul's really awesome Star Wars figures. How cool are these, guys? I just think they're absolutely awesome. So my fave is the Ahsoka. I just love Ahsoka. Okay, then we have, going up here, we have box that I was going to put the books in. I have to ship them. I have some bulk because we always have magic cards laying around. I have my magic notebook, um, which is really, really empty. I like it's running low on pages. I need to get a new one. I have a purse here. Here I have a couple of random things. These are a couple of workouts that I need to do for my knee, my headphones, Christmas gifts. This is a birthday gift for my friend Brad that I need to give him. Um, this is going to be my Queen Alina deck, but it's not going to be in this deck box. I just ordered a new one. I have my brushes and my makeup, and this is my TBR, all of my stuff that I need to read. I try to keep a pretty small TBR around this many books or so. Um, we are reading the Aragon series right now. We are reading the first one. This is my first time reading it, actually. So. Okay, I have stacks of magic cards literally everywhere and everywhere. So we have, I believe these are all lands. I need to put these away. These are cards that need to go in my um, the box, which we'll talk about a little bit. I use this to clean my retainer. This is... Who is this? Marchesa. Marchesa. I have my magic list of um, cards that I get for, um, you know, like I show you guys in hauls and stuff, which that I need to put that on there. Paul got me this Christmas gift. How lovely. Some stickers, some half price books, coupons, because my favorite store in the whole world. Random magic cards that I need to figure out what to do with. Um, these also need to go in the box, my planner for next year. A stack of things. I always have a stack of stuff that needs to go to work. Like always, 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 without a doubt. This is my stack of stuff that needs to go to work. Primarily, it's stickers and washi tape. The kids love it. I've got my pens. I've got um, this thing that Paul and I are gonna do. This is my um, books that I read this year. I read 101 books. Currently, there's still a couple days left in December. I don't know when you guys are gonna see this. 
And then I have um, just some work stuff. I have these oblivion rings, which I had somebody custom do those for me. And then we have the box in my office right now because I use this a lot. And with Paul's office, it just I needed it. I have one of my um, binders, the cat tunnel, a little ball, and then this this little um, cat thing, which the cats like because I sit on top of it. And my mouse, you know. These are fabulous. I love them. You can see them in the background of my videos. I think you can just see the Zelda one. I don't know if you can see the link. I don't think. I think it's too far away, but I absolutely love these. Paul got these for me for, from Comic-Con, like, I don't even know how long ago. I absolutely love them. We got them for free, and they are just so incredibly cool. So, that, and then we have my chair. Secret Lab chair. Pretty cool, pretty cool. We got the filming set up, so I have my microphone. We've got the camera beautiful wedding photo. We love to see it. I have this really, really awesome typewriter that my aunt got me as a gift a while back, along with this really, really, really cool patch that my friend Carrie gave me. Magic cards, because like, why would I not have magic cards on my desk? You know what I mean? We got our Starbucks planning stuff, papers, stickers, and all that stuff. So that was a like five minute office tour. There you go. So I didn't even show you guys like the drawers and stuff in my thing. But anyways, that's my office tour. This is what I'm working with. I love my office. I do you need to clean up my shelves? This bookcase right now, the third one, gets a little bit out of hands. Um, it's just, it's kind of like my, I just put stuff there, you know what I mean? Because I don't have a ton of room on my desk and I do want to keep my desk clean because I'm using it all the time and I want to make sure that it's like I'm not having a lot of clutter and stuff on it. Also too, it, it really isn't that big of a space actually. A lot of the stuff I have on it already takes up a solid amount of space. So anyways, one of my goals hopefully today, maybe tomorrow, is to go through these shelves, is to go through those shelves and take care of them and clean them up a little bit because they are a little bit unorganized. So that is a goal. Also, that magic box is not normally there. So that's like another free shelf that I'll have. So anyways, like I do keep a couple things on there because that one purse doesn't fit in my thing. I need to, I need to adjust my shelves. They're a little bit of a pain to adjust. Um, the whole thing is adjustable shelves, which is really cool, which is exactly what I wanted. Anyways, okay, here's why you're here. So basically, I have filming days every, I don't know, couple of months or so, um, where basically I bulk film. It's easier for my schedule. And so what I like to do um, before I even start filming is I like to do a lot of prep and figuring out what videos I am going to um, do. And so basically what I do is I've written a lot of them down in my planner and I calculate how many videos that I need to film so that way I'm nice and organized. Now, sometimes I think of ideas, but I don't write them down. The joys of being a writer. And so basically this is with me right now. I'm not gonna do all these because there's nine videos and there's actually one that I think I need to do, but I didn't write it down. So I have my Marchesa deck tech, which I know I'm gonna do. I have my Marchesa deck, I should go grab it. My 2024 wish list, top Aquaria cards, Black and then blue staples. I have my Reen deck tech, budget de um, deck tech for AC, my Mugus deck tech, magic cards I want to run, and then a real talk. So that I have on the tip of my head. Oh, it's my top cards from this year as well that I'm going to be filming. And this vlog also counts. So I don't need to film all those videos, but there are a couple of highlights of things that I do want to film on that list. Um, those deck techs, Reen for sure. And I also want to film um, Marchesa as well. That's like one of my top videos that I know that for sure that I'm going to do. So that's definitely on the list of things to do. Um, so basically, I need to figure out what exactly I'm going to film right now, my wish list and all that stuff. So I'm going to put makeup on, but I don't obviously need for like my deck text. That doesn't matter. Also for my deck text, I do need to um, get the cards. I need to update them on tapped out, which I will show you guys what that looks like. Because I want to make sure my decks are all set to go on tapped out and all that sort of stuff. And all the foil versions are up and all its things because I do like foil magic cards. And obviously, if you're interested in buying these these cards, you know, you can obviously not get the foil. I mean, there you go. So anyways, but I'm looking through this and I'm figuring out what exactly I want to film first. And I think I'm going to do my wish list. I think that's actually the, the video that I want to do because that's one of the ones that I want to get up earlier than that. And then I also want to film that top cards because those are both videos that I know are going to go up either the end of December or in January. There you go. I'm just throwing you guys down right there. I'm on my computer right now, of course. And I, I, I said my wish list right. I do that all the time. I'm just like, what did I say I was going to do? And then I have to like think about it. So I've had this Starbucks since 
it is currently 1.15 and I've had this since about 10. I am a ridiculously slow, like cold tea drinker. Like whenever I get a chai or a matcha, those are like basically the only things I drink. I'm not a coffee drinker, which is honestly, I find very hilarious because being in my profession, everybody, you know, or just, I would just say like being an adult in general, it's like the norm. It's like the thing to do, you know, is to like be like a coffee drinker. And I just feel like I'm like, I do feel like a little bit of a unicorn because like not everybody doesn't drink coffee and I just find that very interesting. So anyways, basically here's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to go through my wish list that I have up right now. It is presently sitting at four pages, which I'm definitely going to get it down to three. There's just a little bit on the bottom and it's actually just reprints of cards. It's my Ravnica Remastered wish list. So right now is I'm actually going to go through this and I'm going to pick out the cards that I want to talk about in the video. I'm not going to sit here and talk about all three card pages. We would just be here for a really long time. Do you want to hear me talk for that time? Because I really don't. I, um, I always like, I find it so funny. I tell my kids this like all the time when they're just like, when they like, they need to leave and I'm like, like, yeah, like it's, it's time like for us to go. Like you have to go to like wherever your specials or whatever. And they're like, I don't want to leave you. And I was like, you've been with me for so long. Aren't you sick of me? Because, like, I'm sick of me. <laughs> they're so cute. I love my kids. So, anyways, that's what I'm going to do right now. And I'll see you guys. All right. So, I have just gone in and gone through my wish list. Basically, I did have to go through a couple of my decks. Probably took me about maybe 20 minutes or so to go through all my list and get the specific cards that I want. Basically, what I do is I put them on a separate, so this is my Google Doc that I have where I keep all my video ideas, that way this is like my description box, and I'm not done with this one yet, I still, this is my next project is to, to finish this one, this is my top cards of the year, and then this one's my wish list one, so I basically just went through like my fancy it's not fancy. My wish list, basically, I'm obviously not talking about every cards. The cards in bold are basically cards that I just ended up getting. So I just wanted to keep that a little bit more organized because what I like to do is I kind of like to keep those cards in the back of my head so that I know, okay, those are the cards that I'm doing. Um, popped a kettle on the stove for some tea, even though I'm not done with my Starbucks yet. I have to go, when, I, when I'm when i at work, I go into the cafeteria and I literally grab ice so I can like replenish and like refill because I don't like, I don't like this part of the drink that you come to when it's like this much left and you're like, okay, trekking along, but it, like it's not cold, so that'll drive me crazy. So I need to make sure it's nice and cold, but I'm gonna switch over to hot tea in just a little bit. Um, but basically in order to complete me getting ready for this video, um, basically I will just put on some makeup Obviously, I don't have to do that, but that's just something that I like to do. And um, also, too, I mean, the lights, they really do wash you out. Like, I know a lot of people say that, but it's, like, very true. Um, and also, too, the lighting in here. I mean, this is just, like, the lighting that came from the house or whatever. I do have a light that I use um, for my camera, and it is, she is a bright. She's, like, really does wash you out, and I'm already pretty pale. So, anyways, I'm going to go watch a video, pop on some makeup. And right, Paul has just super kindly brought me my hot tea. We have some English breakfast. It's a little bit late for me to be having English breakfast in the day. Um, it's like 2 p.m. Normally I stick to caffeine like 2 p.m. and before. Um, as I say, as I'm still drinking the Starbucks, that has not a lot left, but there you go. I did my makeup. There we go. I just did my camera a little bit. Also, my mic is, oh, and I've also put my um, light on my studio light or is that a studio light? I don't know. It's a light. Whatever it is. Um, my mic is also on this side. Normally, it's actually over here. Um, the reason why it's like that, I mentioned we have the leak in Paul's office. Yeah, leak in Paul's office. So, to minimize sound, this is what Paul told me to do. I don't know, guys. I'm just, I'm not techie. He is. It's just, it's just what we do. So, before I actually start filming, there's a lot of, like, before, 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 before. Um... <laughs> I am going, so a lot of prep, I think that's what like some people don't, I think, realize always is like, there's a lot of like prep that goes into videos, even like a really simple video like this. It's like just me talking about cards and prepping and putting all the images. I have all the TCG player links up in me right now so I can talk about prices and then I'm putting them on the list or whatever. So like I didn't start sitting down to like know that I was going to do this video until like 1.40, 1.15 or so is when I think I might have started this. I can't remember. Something like that. It's almost two o'clock now, so it's been taking a minute. So anyways, 
I do a test. I always do an audio test. Even if I've been filming, even if I touch zero settings, I always do an audio test. Always. Because I do not want to be in a situation where I film the whole entire video and none of the audio has been picked up because I have this, I'm using OBS and you know all that sort of stuff also my camera my mic is in a little bit of a different spot so i want to make sure especially too that i'm in the clear and that i'm in the go because i do not want to do that so we put our thing on i always have to like squint and like look the other way because oh she is so bright okay so there you go there you go okay i might need to adjust by bringing that a little bit closer okay start recording okay this is a test this is a test and i talk like as I normally do. I don't get particularly loud or anything like that. I just do like my normal talking voice. I am a touch quiet, but that does make sense because it's a little bit further away from me. So I'm just gonna scooch me a little bit up and now I am ready to go. So I'm gonna go ahead and start filming this video and I'll check back in with you guys when I am done. Okay, so I just film, finished filming that video and to be honest with you guys, it was a huge struggle. I was coughing so much. Um, I, I don't feel like when I was filming this or whatever, I was struggling at all, but for some reason that video like really was really hard for me and my lungs. So obviously I'm recovering from the flu. So there you go. Um, but I do want to take a little bit of a break from talking, but I still want to be productive and I still want to do, um, magic related things. So what I'm actually going to do right now is I'm going to do my Marchesa um, Zach Tech, but I actually have to organize it. I have to organize it by lands and update that on Tapped Out. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm also gonna go get myself some cough drops because my cough has been really, really, it's not as like deep as my cough has been, but it's just been like, I'll just be talking and I just have to like stop and cough. So I'm gonna go do that and I'll be right back. So I have this cough drop in my mouth. I have just organized my Commander deck my Marchesa deck and I uploaded and put it all on TC on tapped out um <clears throat> I actually had a deck on here that I started a while back um I ended up just deleting it it had like everything in the maybe board basically that was a really that was like two years ago back when I was like thinking about making this deck um it is now 250 one video is down which just sounds like a crazy because like we started this at like 115 or whatever um but anyways I'm going to flip the camera around. So basically, I'm actually going to take off my, um, what's it called? My uh, light. Whenever I take my camera and I flip it so that it's facing, like, so y'all can see the cards on here, I always do this. And I always make my, I put my keyboard up here and I always make, like, little stacks for cards um, in, like, what I want to talk about. I have my deck on tapped out, tapped out as well, so I make sure that I throw this in the, the Google Doc. I try to keep myself very organized, you know? We always start with lands because that's just what we do. It always just makes the most sense. And then we're gonna do probably then artifacts, and then we'll do enchantments, instance of sorceries, and then we'll do our creatures. So I'm gonna flip the camera around and then I'm gonna go film this. All right. I am in a different outfit. Basically, even though I bulk film, I changed my outfit for many reasons. One, so you're not seeing me in the same out clothes. And two, so that way I can differentiate when I my videos are going up that like, oh, okay, like this is what um, I'm wearing. I have another cough drop in my mouth because I've just been coughing so much. I wanna keep filming, but I think this will probably be my last video of the day, um, which only three videos, that's actually still like a really small, um, that's not really a lot of ideas for me uh, to film. Normally I film like five or so. Uh, I need to film eight and I need to do that, so. But I'll hardly do tomorrow. Just because this cough is, even with these cough drops, is just really, really inhibiting me from filming. So basically, while you were gone, um, I went through, I'm doing my top cards of um, 2023. So what I did is I went through all those, got the cards up, up on my screen so that way I can see them and uh, to reference them. And then I um, went through as well and did my honorable mentions because basically in the video, these are cards that like I have purchased, I played with, I like. But I want to unroll mentions of cards that like I haven't yet purchased, but cards that I need to purchase that are on my wish list sort of thing. So I went through and like went through my wish list. Gars reference that. It is like 
almost four o'clock. It's about 3.50. Like I said, I think this is going to be my last video of the day because my throat is just really bothering me. And it's funny because I don't know if it's just because I'm talking so much that my voice is just like, nah, don't, don't, don't do this. So anyways, let's go ahead and um, upload or upload. See, now I can't talk. Let's go ahead and start filming. Okay guys, so I just finished filming my um, top cards of the year. My cough has definitely calmed down a lot, which is really great. Um, I And it's funny because the rest of me, like I feel okay, like I feel fine and I definitely feel the best that I have in, in a couple of days, but it's just that cough that is just really, really nagging. I think this is just because it's the most talking I've done in multiple days. So I think it's just, you know, beating me up a little bit right now. But um, I'm going to end this vlog here. It's about 4, 4 um, 15 or so. And I um, just really wanted to call this vlog just so you can kind of see like a little bit like behind the scenes of kind of like what's going on. There's a lot of like tech stuff obviously here, which I didn't even necessarily show you guys. Like I have my folder right now that I'm looking at where I basically name all my videos, especially like when I get a lot of clips incoming too. And like I'm editing a video like a month later, like I don't remember what it was. So I want to make sure that I do that. So, um, you guys let me know if you enjoyed this video and if you'd like to see future ones where I, you know, could take you guys on a day filming and also like let me know if you want to see like a more end up office tour. Um, especially too, once I clean up a little bit, that bookshelf to be cleaned is on my list. I just need to add it. I'll probably do that tomorrow. Cause it's a little bit late in the day and I've been, I mean, working for the last like three hours or so on YouTube stuff, which really isn't like that much time in the grand scheme of like, I've done more hours, but before then I ran to the post and I was doing other stuff. And so it's just time for me to be wrapped up for the day for this little project, but I will be back to it tomorrow to finish up the rest of my filming. Um, I think I mentioned in total I needed um, 11 videos um, in total to have done. Um, I believe it's actually 12 that I need, but I am holding a slot just in case I do talk about Streets of New Capenna. Uh, no, not Streets of New Capenna. Murders of Carlo of Manor. I don't know why I said Streets of New Capenna. I don't know why that was on my head. Um, but I do have that. And then this video also, this vlog also counts. So I did the vlog. I did the Marchesa deck tech. I did the top cards of 2023, and then I did my wish list. So four videos today, which is definitely really solid. I will be filming the rest of them hopefully tomorrow and maybe take some medicine before, assuming that my, my vo if my voice is still um, struggling. So guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel for not